Hello, calculus learners. In previous videos, we talked about constructing Taylor series and integrating Taylor series and multiplying Taylor series and constructing new Taylor series using substitution. And now we're going to talk about taking a derivative of a Taylor series. So the example that we're going to work with today is e to the x. So here's our foundation for everything e to the x is equal to 1 plus x plus x squared over 2 factorial plus x cubed over 3 factorial, and so on. And if we want to write that using summation notation, then that is the sum from n equals 0 to infinity of x to the n over n factorial. Now, we talked about creating a new series using substitution. So the Taylor series for e to the x squared can be found by using the Taylor series for e to the x. And wherever we saw an x, we just write in x squared. So substituting x squared in here, and here, and here, and here, and so on, and all of those places, we get 1 plus x squared plus x to the 4 over 2 factorial plus x to the 6th over 3 factorial plus x to the 8 over 4 factorial, and so on. And writing this in summation notation, same exact idea. We're just replacing all of the x's up here with x squared. So that means we have almost the exact same summation, but instead of an x right there, we've got x squared there. All right, so that's our Taylor series for e to the x squared. Now I said that we want to talk about taking derivatives in this video. So let's go ahead and give ourselves give ourselves a goal. Let's try to find the derivative of x times e to the x squared. All right, so first thing we want to do then is find x times e to the x squared. So we just need to multiply x by everything here. So that gives us x plus x cubed plus x to the 5 over 2 factorial plus x to the 7 over 3 factorial plus x to the 9 over 4 factorial and so on. Or if you like to write it again using summation notation, we can do that. We're going to take the derivative of the sum from n equals 0 to infinity, x to the 2n plus 1 over n factorial. Okay, so let's go ahead and take this derivative. The derivative of x is 1. The derivative of x cubed is 3x squared. The derivative of x to the 5 over 2 factorial is 5x to the 4 over 2 factorial. The derivative of x to the 7 over 3 factorial is 7 x to the 6th over 3 factorial. The derivative of x to the 9 over 4 factorial is 9x to the 8 over 4 factorial, and so on. All right, so that would be our Taylor series expansion of the derivative of x times e to the x squared. So we just go ahead and take the derivative term by term, and it's really nice and easy because we know how to take derivatives of polynomials.